Hello guys, today I'm making a catapult. This is the final result. I'll find that later. For now, all you need is a big piece of wood, some glue, a bottle cap, a, pi a pin, you can use wood ones, but I just found a plastic one. Some lollipop sticks. I have an extra one if one breaks. A measuring tape. Because I don't want to stick the thing wrong. You start by uh, putting some glue on the uh, wooden uh, pole though. but I'm gonna put it here to know exactly how long this takes this is a big thing Grind. This is going to take a while. So now we have to stick both of these popsicle sticks together. Well, we just have to put some glue on both of these. That is serious? Ah, because I close. It's so close, I forgot to open it. No. Yep, there it goes. Well, what? From my angle, it looks like this popsicle stick was moving on. It's on. This is the most annoying part. Trying to align these two sticks without making your fingers uh, glowy. Okay, now my fingers are all full. We'll just wait a little. Well, yeah, I think it would make it better if we do the next step while this is dry. All we have to do in this step is just put some glue on the edge of I don't know, know how far it has to be. Okay, let me check with this. Mm, like this. I'd say to put it like here. About there. About here I would put it. I would put it. You guys can test out with different spots. And comment down below how far is the best Okay, now it's leaking out glue. That's not a good thing to have when you're making art. Minus if you're making a glue fountain that would slowly but surely dry away. Well, now, uh, later I'll use this measuring tape. That can cook, and because I'm a bit uh, old, I can use this. But if you're like less than six or like that, you should probably tell your mom and dad to uh, use the magic these metal ones because you can cut your finger off. 
Mm. Well, we'll come back to this later. But I sort of have to go to my jujitsu class. I literally have to go right now. We'll check back later. Sorry. I'm back from jujitsu now. Let's continue. This really didn't stick on. This is not a good glue to use. It's better to use like a wood glue or something. Well, this part is just uh, put some glue on it. And it has to be at least five centimeters up. That's why I add this med tape. Five centimeters. Five centimeters. So from here. Out. About that much is five centimeters. Yeah, I think that. Is that five centimeters? Five. More than five. Oh wait, was I talking this entire time? Yeah, that's about five. Five point five can work. Bye bye. <laughs> I made this yesterday because I knew this glue and this will take until tomorrow to actually dry they use these in the ancient times to launch rocks and heavy stuff to destroy castles and other structures but today i'm gonna use this catapult to launch a a bomb looking like... Okay, this is supposed to be for tennis, but I'm using it for this. There he is. Okay. I just got some more cargo. But this time, I actually got something that might work like a rock. I mean, I'm gonna load multiple of these. Let's try three. Let, now let's try about all of them now. I shouldn't have my windows open because it's gonna be a big blast. Three, two, one. It's raining. Look at that. Okay, let's see, maybe a few more. Well, I'm picking these up for the last special launch. Let's talk about how this works. Why I made this video. First, because I was bored. Second, because I heard a catapult and I wanted to make a catapult to shoot it at Ginger. So she can chase the ball. I'm not gonna shoot actual rocks at you. My pussy cat. To shoot like balls. Her bouncy balls. I should have got some targets. Well, uh. Well, I'm putting this for the final launch. Don't forget to. Like and subscribe. Boom. Bye. Goodbye.